Hi everyone, Julie here again. Welcome back to the YouTube channel. Last week I did a video on using the geometry panel in DxO Photo Lab 7 and what I did was I showed you some of the images from our Hera Goddess beach shoot with model Nicola and I thought I would bring in another one of the images this time something a little more closer up and I thought I would go through how to get rid of some of the blemishes and get rid of some of the flyaways in a bit more detail so what I've done is I have boosted my exposure on this image a little bit because it was still a little bit dark so I have boosted that up when it comes to working on like a face and stuff like that I recommend going into at least a hundred percent and then you can come through and you can see in detail what you need to fix then I'm going to grab the retouch tool and if you can't see the mask just turn the masks on and I'm going to come through and I'm going to get rid of some of the blemishes now if you want to see what some of the selections are just grab it and you can grab the little toggle and you can move it along you can increase or decrease the size of your brush and sometimes it's easier just to move in sort of smaller sections How much retouching and cleaning up you want to do is obviously entirely up to you now this little hand if you hit the space bar that gives you that little hand which is very handy <laughs> pardon the pun to move it around within your frame and you can always see where you are if you grab that little navigation tool you can use that to move yourself around as well so I'm going to just do a quick little clean and tidy up I'm going to speed it up and I'll see you back in a minute So wow that was a, a lot to get rid of around the mouth um, the joy of working with in windy conditions so that's the before and that's the after so you can see that it's got rid of quite a lot of those flyaways um, there's just a few other little things I want to get rid of now it's up to you how fussy you want to be and how many flyaways you want to get rid of some people are quite happy to leave most of the flyaways because they were there in shot I guess but for me I just wanted to get rid of some of them some of the blemishes the lighting even though it was quite overcast the lighting was still a little bit on the harsh side okay so let me just zoom out a little bit so I can see what we're looking with I've still got quite a few blemishes and flyaways on her forehead so I'm going to speed it up a little bit and I'm going to go and get rid of some of them <music> can of course increase the size of your brush on some areas to make the job just a little bit quicker especially as I've got sort of just this 
this gray background behind me that it's pretty easy to work with I don't want to remove all the flyaways because I want it to look like she was out in the wind so as you can see there's an awful lot that I have gotten rid of um, I haven't even done her body yet so let's just Okay, so I think I'm pretty happy with that. I can then go ahead and do any editing to that that I want to if I want to come in and do some masking. So if I go into the masking panel, I can then do things like brush in some highlights around her eye. So I'm just going to brush that in. So I've got the feathering up quite a bit and I'm painting that in on the eyes and I have brought the highlights up a touch so that it has a bit of a highlight in her eye because we didn't have any reflectors or anything like that that we were using on this shoot we were using the light reflecting off the water and the sand and just to finish off, I'm just going to pop into the color and I'm going to go into the light grading. I'm going to go back into that premium set and I'm going to go into that cold sovereignty again. really liked what it did to the image. I'm just going to drop the intensity down a little bit. I don't want to completely lose all the colors. That's it for removing blemishes and flyaways using the retouch tool in DxO's Photo Lab 7. So thanks for watching and I hope to see you next time on the YouTube channel. Don't forget to like and subscribe. Bye for now.